today we're going to be revisiting an older video to see what sold, what I made a profit on, and what I probably could have left on the shelf. Well, we are here today in Chambersburg, Pennsylvania, and we are at Black Rose Antiques and Collectibles also known as the land of the poodles. Uh, we are here today to do a little shopping and see what we can find to buy and flip for a profit. Here we go. Let's sit down there, it's kind of pretty. What is this? Is it Kaiser? Oh, four piece Kaiser set, $12.95. Well, shoot, I feel like that's reasonable. Let's grab that out of there. That's a pretty floral design. There we go, four pieces. She's a pretty lady, isn't she? Oh, she's Franklin Mint. This is a moment of deja vu. I think we've done that before. It's a shame that the stopper is missing out of this one. Look at those hand-painted pieces. <laughs> These look like moon and stars. Cologne, lotion, my secret. <laughs> My secret what? Unpainted race imports. That's kind of fun, isn't it? Except I'm very confused. Lotion. Does it go that direction? The one in the middle is reverse. Okay. How much is that? Let's see. I don't see a price on it. Price is $19.95. There is a 20% discount. I think we're gonna grab it. It's already in the in the cart. And a few vases. The pair of vases for only eight dollars and ninety-five cents. Hmm. Okay. Since it's the pair, we'll grab them. Those are also 20% off. Oh, that looks fancy. What is that? Vase nautical. That's really quite cool. There is an embossed mark on the bottom. I've never seen a vase like that before. It's a Jack in the Pulpit style, and it has this medallion with a painted nautical theme. It's 1995, but I feel like that's unique. It's not something I see every day, so we'll stick that in here. Goodness, this is new. I don't remember all of these treasures being here the last time. Oh my. Look at all these deer. $2.95 each? My gosh, and I can't remember who makes them. Drawing a blank. Only $2.95 each? I feel like there is money to be made there. I'm half tempted to just throw them all in my cart, but. Maybe just one of every color. So I filled up on one of every color. <laughs> I even got one of these larger ones that was over there. I'm not moving on quite yet. I want to see what else they have. Look at this guy. He's fun. $3.95 condiment jar. Anthropomorphic. He's missing a spoon, but um, we'll stick him in there. There's some anthropomorphic shakers. No price on that guy. So there's a price on this one. Oh, 
It's a pair for $4.95 and 20% off. This is so exciting. Like I'm having a little bit of a hard time focusing, I'm not gonna lie. These are great, what are these? They're egg cups and shakers. Oh my gosh, get in my cart. <laughs> this guy, he's got a rolly blow. Oh, he's a shaker, he's the same, he's an egg cup. I'm gonna grab the egg cups here in a second. I love these, they're colorful. I think they need to go in the cart. And then we're gonna move, I'm just gonna wheel my cart into here so we can start filling up. This here is a Hager piece, but there's a lot of chipping on the edge, so I'm gonna leave that. I like the looks of this owl on the back on the moon. It's just a planter. No markings on that. How much is it? $4.95, like I'm, not, I'm catching myself not even looking at the prices because it's pretty reasonable. I love these, I've had these before. $6.95. Hippo. There's a dog as well. $4.95 each. <laughs> I've, I've got two voices in my head right now. One is saying, you have enough stuff. You're listening by yourself. You really don't need to load up. And the other voice is saying, that's a great price. You should totally grab that. And I'm, I'm just, I'm trying to decide which one to listen to, but I think I'm going to grab them and stick them in my cart. This piece is uh, Freeman McFarlane Originals California Pottery. It's only $5.50. This is great. What is this? Chicken candle holder. Maybe like of a terracotta. There's a candle in there. I have to make sure I don't tip it out. That's kind of fun. Only four. That's <laughs> only four dollars. This is what I'm saying. These are like better than thrift store prices, especially lately. Four bucks. Okay. I figured we would look through here. I'm seeing a lot of the same ones that were here the last time, so I don't think there's any new ones here. Dobermans are still here. At least one of them. That one's the resin one. This is so cute. What is this? Six dollars. White poodle figurine on pillow. Oh, it's got damage. Oh yeah, it does. <laughs> I'm like looking, I'm like looking at the tail. Like the tail looks good. And meanwhile, staring at a giant repair. <laughs> it's sweet though. It looks like he's got cheese in his mouth. Six dollars. It could be displayed like this, but I'm not going to talk myself into it. A poodle lamp. Ooh. Look at her. She's got attitude. Very snooty. $28 on that. Looks to be in decent condition. There may be a petal missing on one of the flowers on her hat, but it's kind of hidden with the shade. I think I'm going to do that for $28. Needs a new shade. I don't think that's the right shade for it, but I love her attitude. Okay, so I've found the ca the other case that is full of poodles, and I decided to start looking through here to see if anything caught my eye. I think we only got a few of the um, Basil Matthews poodles out of here the last time I visited. And I'm not really seeing any more of those. That one back there is Germany. I like the green coloring. Oh, and this one is Yadro. The one back here I was knowing is Bezik. I think I might get the Bezik Poodle. Our other Bezik Poodle just sold, so it might be worth picking up another one at this point. Um, but I think that's it. Oh, I lied. Here's another Basil Matthews. I think I'm going to take that little guy. He's littler than the other ones. It looks like maybe a puppy. That looks interesting. It's a Zolzny. $20. Ooh, I totally missed that. I actually have um, a Zolzny, I'm not even sure if I'm pronouncing it right, sculpture in our eBay right now. So, all right, let's get some of this out. And then the back is interesting, $75. They have uh, Doris Dawson on there. I might look her up. Oh wait, I don't have a cell signal. I can't. Uh, $75, it makes me a little nervous. I actually hadn't noticed this poodle until uh, they opened the case, but this is made in England. He has a little bit of an issue there with his tail, but he's only $10. This 
This tail's wagging. That's what's happening. <laughs> this one right here. That's marked on the bottom. Take that. The one says so this guy here. Oh, there we go. Uh, Twenty-two dollars. Right, I'll take him. There's that. There's a Basil Matthews sheep for forty. It's not a poodle, but it kind of looks like a poodle. <laughs> And then in the back, this one is the one we wanted to look at. There we go. I don't see any damage on that. Alright, I will take this one. up front for me. Um, I'm probably just gonna stick around here a little bit longer and see what we can find. So over here is a Jordan Imports Company fish dish for only 20 bucks. And that could be worth it for 20. Oh my gosh. Okay, well my total spend here at Black Rose today was $348. I was actually really surprised. I thought it was going to be a lot more, but we did get a lot of stuff for really good prices. So that's probably why it wasn't insane. Um, today was exciting. It was like walking in and it was like, oh my gosh, look at all this stuff. And uh, better than thrift store prices. I say it a lot, but it's definitely true. So I'm going to get out of here now. I'm not sure yet where I'm heading. Probably going to head towards home if I'm being honest. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see all of you tomorrow. So long. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you spotted something you just can't live without, we do post 25 to 30 new items in our eBay shop every single day. And I've posted a link to that down in the description. If you enjoyed this video, we will be posting videos just like this every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. So make sure you stay tuned. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I have included a link to the playlist down in the description.